fucking job, but you couldn't fucking do that! There's a silver lining. We didn't completely fuck it up. Get up, boy. I recognize those eyes anywhere. <laughs> I'm so sorry about this. This was supposed to be. Well, not this. We have a party waiting for you, but I don't think I know your name. Who is this? Is this your plus one? <laughs> Strong, silent type. I like it. I am terribly embarrassed about all of this. This was supposed to be very simple, but you know, if you give food to monkeys, they just throw their shit at each other. You know? Oh, would you hold this? For just a moment, I want to get a little... Sure, right into the camera. There we are. Awesome. Don't worry about a thing, my boy. This will soon be behind us. And we'll be off on our grand adventure. Because I have cleared my calendar for you. You and I are gonna tear shit up! <laughs> should I stay or should I go? Give my congratulations to Ashley on your next visit home. I must say, Paul, your little corner of Kiratu is rather beautiful. I expected more. You know, chains and wailing, but knowing you somewhere around here is a dark place where the secrets flow like the blood. <laughs> that wry smile betrays you again, Diplom. <laughs> well, go on, take the bloody bag off his head. Again, terribly sorry for what happened before. This is more what I had in mind. So, fresh start. Introductions. RJ Gale, our guest of honor. Paul, our very gracious host. The little monkey, whose name I still don't know. And I, of course, am Pagan Men. You really don't remember me, do you? Your mother, she never spoke of me, never mentioned me. We'll change all that. Paul, I need cash. Uh, how much do you need? All of it. Thank you. Here we go. Ah. Hmm? All right. Like this with the smile. <clears throat> That's you. That's me. Although I'm not so sure anymore. Now, your mother. Your mother, on hey. the other hand, she understood me. She knew me in a way that no one ever did. That takes me back. The last time I saw Ishwari was years ago. She told me she loved me. Women, they can do that. They can tell you they love you in the moment and mean it. Men, on the other hand, no, men only really love you in hindsight. And too much distance has built up. So, when your mother decided to flee to the United States with you on her hip, I couldn't help but blame myself. Then I realized, it's not me, no. It was the fucking golden path. Those fucking terrorists, they ruin everything. Like dinner. Did no one ever teach you that it's rude to text at the table? Let's see here. It'd be fun. Really, guys? We're not checking for these anymore? Ah, I'm with RJ Gale. You'll love this part. Help. <laughs> A text for help. You don't text for help, you cry for help. So come on, you're gonna cry for help. If you're gonna do something, you're gonna do it right. Here we go. Go on. Cry for help. Cry for help. Help? Oh, 
that air. No, cry for help. Help! You mean it, boy. Help! help! From your diaphragm! Help! 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 Shh, 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 shh. Now we listen. Nothing. I'm afraid they're not coming for you, buddy. <laughs> oh! Find out what he knows. Terrorists, right? Now, please, stay right here. Enjoy the crab rangoon. Don't move. I will be right back. Yuma, we need to talk. What the fuck? Let's rewind for a bit because, oh, fuck, but you know exactly what I want. Now, do you know why you are here? <laughs> You're Golden Pass, a terrorist, a bad guy, and I'm a good guy, which means that I don't really want to hurt you. I only want to listen. And, you know, people tell me that I'm a fantastic listener. So if you'll just tell me who your friends are, what it is they're planning, and when it's going to happen, we can avoid them. <laughs> now, we already know you've been spying on the compound. So how do you know Ajay Gale? What does the Golden Path want with him? Hey, babe. Hey, listen, I'm in a meeting right now. I can't really talk. Yeah, you know, it is stressful times over here. We've got a new client, and I am not sure he's going to buy it. No, I, I will call you as soon as it is done. I don't think it'll take much longer. Yeah. How are the girls? Yeah. Good, 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 good. 
give everyone a big kiss for me, okay? I love you. Ajigali. My name is Sabah. I'm with the Golden Path. Golden Path? We're friends. I knew your father. We're here to rescue you, son of Moa. What about Darpan? You are our priority. We need to get you out of here safely, no matter the cost. Darpan would understand. Now stay close. Shit, they know we're here. The door! Quickly! Ajay, with these doors open, I need you to keep your head down and make a run for the truck. Move as fast as you can. Understand? Yeah, yeah, I got it. One, two, three! Hey, here we go. The driver's dead. Okay, listen to me. Look around. You should be able to see a tower nearby. I need you to make your way there. I'm on my way to secure it now. Head to the tower. Okay. You can do this, Ajay.
My boy, are you busy? You don't mind me calling, do you? Fantastic. You really are an excellent listener. Look, no hard feelings about the crab rangoon. I know it's not to everyone's taste. But you'll be pleased to know I had the chef executed for his incompetence. Or was it his family we killed? <laughs> Regardless, next time I can promise you a better spread. That's the last time I'm kidnapping a fucking TV celebrity chef. <laughs> It's an honor to meet you, son of Mohan. I'm amazed you made it all the way here on your own. Sabal is waiting for you near the tower. Archie, you made it! Good job, son of Mohan. Why are you guys helping me? You're the son of Mohan Kale. You may not know it, but that name carries a lot of weight in Kirat. Especially for the Golden Bar. Are those army guys still looking for me? Pagan men will stop at nothing to get you back. Damn. Some of Pagan's men managed to track us. They'll be here any second. We're in for a fight. You're a tough man to kill, brother. That's a good thing, right?
How did you know to find me? He saw Bacon's chopper nearby. He's never down this far south, and I wanted to know why. Lucky for you, we were in the area when we got Darpan's text. Well, we're here. Welcome to Banapur, home of the Golden Path. Who's this? Where's Darpan? He didn't make it. This is Ajay Gale, Mohan's son. Let me understand. Darpan's dead, hmm? And you brought me this. I'm not involved in, in whatever this is. I'm just looking for Lakshmana. We're in the middle of a fucking war. We don't have time for tourists. What was I supposed to do? Just leave him there? I'm sorry, brother. Amita's a little touchy. I'll talk to her. As for Lakshmana, it sounds like it could be a temple or shrine. But if that's the case, it's in the north. The north is enemy territory, and we can't get you there, not yet. Go and clear your head. Come find me when you're ready. My husband loves to sew. He used to make clothes for the whole family. Now he makes uniforms for the Golden Path. Look what the wind blew in. Make yourself at home. Look. Considering the war, you're lucky you can still buy and sell items. Stay safe.
Move out! Give him some morphine! And turn off that fucking radio! What happened to him? He fell. Pagan floods the airways and we have to endure his bullshit. Enough is enough! I told him to climb up the old bell tower, take over the transmitters, hijack the broadcasts locally. Except... I can do it. Way to step up, brother. There's nobody guarding it, but it's a tricky climb. Promise me you won't fall. I promise. I won't.
that you? There's nobody here by that name. Damn it. He's overdue. Who is this? AJ Gale. And who is this? Ajay Gale? One moment. Ah, uh, Ajay. Right, I know who you are. I'm Gopal, with the Golden Pass. We could use your help. My unit handles supply drops for the cause, but I'm short-handed here. The Royal Army is resupplying troops in the area. I'm sending you the coordinates for the drop sites now. Grab the packages before the Royal Army can secure them. What's in the packages? Supplies. Things we can use. Okay, I'll get your stuff. Great. One more to go. Good luck. I got them all. That's fantastic. Please hurry and deliver them to this location. Thank you. <laughs> ah. Thank you, Ajay. I'll make sure these get in the right hands. Just leave them at the door. I can't come in? We're preparing a top secret operation in here. Sorry, orders are orders. I can't let anyone inside.
Normally when people get attacked by big predators, they die. Even if they have all kinds of weapons. Sabal says, I shouldn't be doing this. I am teaching you to protect yourself. Ah, the tourist. I'm Amita. This is Badra. Hi. Keep walking. Look, I overreacted back there. We're at war. We keep losing soldiers. The work keeps piling up. Is there anything I can do? I'm not a soldier, but I want to help. Okay. Sure. There's a farm not far from here. Kanan runs it, but she's old, and she could use your help with some wild animals. <sighs> I need you to keep the hides intact, so use this. Badra. What are you... Pick it up. Try again. Very good. Fuck. Uh, Amita sent me over. She said you might have some kind of wild animal problem. Hey, Amita, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. Wolves <sighs> are a common nuisance for Kanan Farm. She's killed off a number of them, but this year they're especially aggressive, and I'm worried about her. There's a den nearby. Clear it out, huh? I think Kadon has supplies stockpiled somewhere on her farm that you can use. And Ajay, skin your kills. We can always use the pelts.
Hey. Badra, how are you? Good. I, uh, brought you these pelts. I thought maybe you could use them. Hmm. These are good, Ajay. But you keep them. She has enough for her Tanka paintings. I'm sorry, Tanka what? This one is about the life of a guru. This one is about the demon Yalung. This one is about the goddess Kira. And that one is about Badra, the next Tarun Matara. But Tarun Matara is a living goddess, if you believe Sabal. It's no life for a child, being treated as an object, thing. <sighs> Thanks for your help. Later, I'll show you how to put those to good use. Longinus. He's a friend to the Golden Path, and he'll be grateful you helped us. Longinus, you said? Yes.
a weapons dealer and a priest, if you can believe that. Longinus is a little crazy, but if you want guns, he's the man you should see. I'll update your map.
Mirana here, and listeners, I got a bone to pick. I am sick of Bugan's propaganda. I mean, it's all bullshit. Seriously, who writes this stuff? Who do you have a PhD in writing bullshit? I, it has to be soul crushing just typing out thousands and thousands of lines of the same shit, saying every day, hey, Bugan is great. Bugan is wonderful. Bugan is awesome. Bugan is an amazing golden god who pisses. Welcome! I am Longinus. And you... You are AJ! Welcome to my church! Away from church! That sells guns? Of course! For the meek shall inherit the earth, my friend. All they need are some good guns. Revelation 5.5. It is the most invigorating read. And one of the elders saith unto me, Weep not! Behold the Lion of the tribe of Judah! The root of David hath prevailed to open the book and loose the seven seals thereof! Uh, it is I... our savior! It is our savior returned to us as a lion, a warrior! So, I started thinking to myself, when the Son of God is reborn, 
What gun would he use? When Christ returns to break the seven seals and bring about the rapture, he returns as a lion, yes? A lion needs teeth. What gun would Jesus choose? Deuteronomy 3247? But there are no empty words for you, but your very life. Or maybe Revelation 1911. The discretion of a man deferreth his anger. I don't know what you're talking about. A soldier knows. A soldier always knows. For we have seen the rapture and survived it. You need guns to do righteous work, AJ. For every gun is a Bible. For every bullet, a sermon. And for every radio tower that you free from pagans' lies, I will give you something. A reward. It is the will of God. Here. This is for the first one. Vanderport is under attack! We need fighters here Sabah, now! What's happening? We're under attack! Stay away! Oh, shit! Go forth into all the world and proclaim the gospel to the whole of creation! Like back then, Audrey. Your mother and I, with you on her hip. Oh, those were the days. She was never happier than she was back then, and I should say the same for myself. We had such plans, not just for our little family, but for Kirat. It wasn't always like this. I long for those days, but then it's too late. I tried, I really, really did, but this place is ruinous. Try not to let them drag you down, Audrey. Ishwari didn't send you back here for that.
Badra, Badra, where are you? People need to see her. It'll comfort them. She's just a child, Sabal, and she's terrified. I'll take her home, and then we'll worry about the people, okay? Thank you. You're okay. <laughs> this is what we get for rescuing Ajay. We hit Paul's house, he slaughters a village. This isn't on Ajay, it's on me. We can't worry about that now. They took the outpost, and they have hostages. Fine. The outpost first. Without it, we're cut off from the others. Come. Protection. We cannot let them down. Rescue the hostages, brother. 